Hello everyone, and welcome back to Undertale. Last time we, you know, we explored a bit of Waterfall. Um, I'd say we're probably like halfway through it-ish by now. But yeah, we explored Waterfall. We, um, we just, we met some new things. We met Monster Kid. We also, um, met a very angry dummy and fought it and won. And then on top of that, we were chased around by Undyne, uh, the leader of the Royal Guard. Um, and yeah, now we're here. Now we're here in a very quiet place. North, Luke Acres, East, Hotland. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Temi Village. Huh. Alright, let's... What's this? It's a duck. Hello! This little bird wants to carry you across. Accept the bird's offer? Not right now. I'll be back, though. What? 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 It's a living. It is indeed a living. Doesn't seem like anyone's home. Hmm. I wonder. <laughs> Hello? It's locked. He really came. I'm sorry, I wasn't expecting that. It's not much, but make yourself at home. Oh yeah. Wait. Didn't I see him last time? I think so. I forgot. It's been like a month. Maybe two. I'm sorry, Naps the Bloke. I forgot we interacted. But now I'm here. Oh, are you hungry? I can get you something to eat. This is a ghost sandwich. Do you want to try it? Yeah. You attempt to bite into the ghost sandwich. You phase right through it. Oh. Never mind. After a great meal, I like to lie down on the ground and feel like garbage. It's a family tradition. Do you want to join me? Yeah. Okay. Follow my lead. Here we go. You'll lie down as long as you don't move. So only move around when you want to get up, I guess. This is nice. Just lying down with a bro. Questioning our existence. Wondering what lies in the vast and great beyond. Yes, this is perfect. Now, shall we question our existence some more? Why are we here? What is our purpose? I don't know any of those answers, so, so let's... Uh, this is becoming a little bit too much for my brain to think about. It's starting to, uh, not work. So let's get up. Well, that was nice. Thank you. Uh, I'm gonna keep working on that mix CD. Oh, uh, that's my TV. There's a show I like to watch on it. Sometimes. The computer's internet browser is opened to a music sharing forum. It's a spider web. There's a flyer for a bake sale on it. The CD is labeled Gulliday Music. Play it? Yeah. 
<laughs> I like it. There's a good beat to it. A very nice melody. Spook wave. Yes. Whoa. <laughs> the fridge is empty. That makes sense. Dang, that ambience. It's like my whole body is being spooked. Oh wait, does, does he say different things? Oh, this one. Once you learn the lyrics, it's hard not to sing along. <laughs> Thank you. Spook tunes. Okay, that's just the same one. Oh, a classic spook tune. They don't make songs like this anymore. Well, it was very nice. Thank you, Naps the Book. Hello? It's a snail. For some reason, you can't help but wonder what it tastes like. Well, snail, snail. A long journey extends in front of you. Snail, snail. Reach far and stretch beyond the horizons. Snail, snail. So snaileth Samboyle. Samboyle? Awkward. I'm working right now. I mean, welcome to Bloke Family Snow Farm. Yeah, I'm the only employee. This place used to get a lot of business, but our main customer disappeared one day. Now it's just some hairy guy that shows up once a month. I've been long overdue for a second house. The snail is counting dollar bills. Oh, I see. Do you want to play a game? It's called Thunder Snail. Snails will race, and if the yellow snail wins, you win. It's 10G to play. Sure, why not? Okay, press Z repeatedly to encourage your snail. Ready? Two, one. Uh. It's gonna work. Trust me, guys. Um, it's okay, just revving up the engine. Oh, looks like you encouraged your snail too much. All that pressure to succeed really got to her. Oh. Oh, well. <laughs> I'll try that again. I'm addicted. You can do it. Oh. Oh. You both tried your best, but the snail looks discouraged. Your best wasn't good enough. Oh. Well, that's okay. We'll try again next time and we'll win. I trust in you, yellow snail. 
quickly shave. Whoa there! I've got some neat junk for sale. Ooh. Looks like a crab. Speed up in battle. Invincible longer. So it doesn't give you any armor. <laughs> I thought it just took away armor, but it just doesn't give you anything. Let's get some CT and grab apple. Try not- <laughs> I'm trying to get rid of my junk, not get more of it. Though I've heard if you want to sell stuff, the Temi Village is your best bet. Where is it? I don't remember. Let's talk. About yourself. I've been around for a long time, maybe too long. Studying history sure is easy when you've lived through so, many, so much of it yourself. The emblem. Oh, you don't know what that is? What are they teaching you kids in school nowadays? What? <laughs> That's the Delta Rune, the emblem of our kingdom. The kingdom of monsters. <laughs> Great name, huh? It's as I always say, old King Fluffy Buns can't name for beans. Emblem's meaning new. That emblem actually predates written history. The original meaning has been lost to time. All we know is that the triangles symbolize us monsters below and the winged circle above symbolizes something else. Most people say it's the angel from the prophecy. It's the prophecy. Oh yeah, the prophecy. Legend has it that an angel who has seen the surface will descend from above and bring us freedom. Lately, the people have been taking a bleak, bleh, taking a bleaker outlook, I'm calling that winged circle and the angel of death. A harbinger of destruction, waiting to free us from this mortal realm. In my opinion, when I see that little circle, I just think it looks neat. <laughs> the king. King Fluffy Buns? He's a friendly, happy-go-lucky kind of guy. If you keep walking around long enough, you'll probably meet him. He loves to walk around and talk to people. Eh? Why don't I call him... <laughs> Why do I call Dreamer Fluffy Buns? Oh, that's a great story. I don't remember it. But if you come back much later, I'm sure I'll have remembered that by then. Blech. About Undyne. Undyne? Yeah, she's a local hero around here. Through grit and determination alone, she fought her way to the top of the royal guard. Actually, she just came through uh she just came through asking about someone who looked just like you. I'd watch your back, kid. And buy some items. It might just save your hide. <laughs> I think I'm good for now. I'll see you later. Be careful out there, kid. Will do. Yes, use the box. Shaw food, ice cream, dog residue. I don't have much for. Should find that Temmie village at some point because. My storage situation is rough. Hurt, beaten, and fearful for our lives, we surrendered to the humans. Seven of their greatest magicians sealed us underground with a magic spell. Anything can enter through the seal, but only beings with a powerful soul can leave. There's only one way to reverse this spell. If a huge power equivalent to seven human souls attacks the barrier, it will be destroyed. But this cursed place has no entrances or exits. There's no way a human could come here. We will remain trapped down here forever. 
Well, that's not true. Maybe you guys- maybe if you guys climbed up, but... Might be a long way down, or long way up, in that case. I wonder how we survived. Hello. Whoa. Special enemy Temi appears here to defeat you. Check. Temi, rated 10 out of 10. Loves to pet cute humans, but you're allergic! Oh, oh, oh can't, <laughs> can't pet you. Oh. I'm allergic. Temi is trying to glomp you. Talk. You say hello to Temi. Oi, I'm Temi. <laughs> Timmy forgot her other attack. Flex. You flex at Timmy. No, muscles are not cute. Oh, I have to disagree. <laughs> no! <laughs> Just the two of us, huh? Oh god. Not the sweaty horse. Ow. Oh my god. Okay, flex. He flex. Aaron flexes very hard. He flexes himself out of the room. I have won nothing but money. Oh. Hoi! Welcome to Temi Village! Or no, Tem Village. Hoi! I'm Temi! And this is my friend, Temi! Hoi, I'm Temi. And this is my friend, Temi. Hoi, I'm Temi. Don't forget my friend. Hi. I'm Bob. I know Bob, and your face kind of looks like him too. <laughs> Rich history of Tem. Slay the dragon. Boy, you should check out Tem shop. You feel something. You're filled with determination. I know what to do this. Boy, welcome to the Tem Shop. <laughs> College Tem pursue higher education. Hill. Dog residue. Whoa! You got dog residues? Mm, I gotta have dog residues, but I gotta pay for cool egg. Mm, so I've always wanted dog residues. No. But, but. No. You will regret this. I'll be right back. I need to. Well, now I'm stuck with the dog residues. Let's get rid of some stuff we don't need. Now we sell. We sell the mandana. We sell the tough glove. We sell the toy knife. Now we have plenty of months. Tim flick on sale. Yeah. Let's talk. Hello. Hoi. I'm Temi. 
about yourself. Hoi, I'm Temmy. Temmy history. Us Tems have a deep history. Don't tell me about it, I guess. Hey, yeah, go to Temp Shop. I can just. Whoa. Got Tem Flakes? Mm, gotta have that Tem Flakes. I gotta pay for cooling. Tim always want to break snow. But, but, <laughs> you sell these. Yeah. Yeah. So it's just an infinite money glitch? How much is this one? Okay, it's the same. Interesting. Well, it was... A pleasure meeting you, Timmy? Goodbye, Timmy. Hey, I agree, you should check Tem Shop. Oh, I forgot to sell my faded ribbon. Oh, wah, wah, wah. Humans, such a cute Tem watch egg. Egg will hatch. Tem proud parent. It's hard to boil. Tem heard human allergics to Tem. That's okay. Tem understand. Tem also allergic to Tem. <laughs> Hoives! Feeling of being watched. Statue of Tem. Very famous. Very. How about you, Kenser? Mushroom dance, mushroom dance. Whatever could it mean? <gasps> the symbol. It symbolizes my inner torment, trapped here by my hyphae. My struggle to pull away, my struggle to escape. But alas, to no avail. Alright, I... Yeah, let's go. <laughs> I think we're done here. Yeah, I think, I think we're good. I think we can go. Let us leave. Small is having quiet time. It's a slime mold. Flirt. You wiggle your hips suddenly. Oh. I didn't like that. Mold bug gyrates reserved. Lie down? You lie down. Moldbug lies down too. Moldbug understands its life now. What? Moldbug needs some distance. Unhug? You don't hug Moldbug. It appreciates your respect of its boundaries. Ow. I didn't do anything to you. Seems comfortable with my presence. Okay. You you keep living your life, mold bug. Without candles or magic to guide them home, the monsters used crifts okay, used crystals to navigate.
the flex. I'm actually blind. Where? Hello? Okay. It's hard to see when that happens. Seven. seven human souls. With the power of seven human souls, our king, King Asgore Dreamer, will become a god. With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the surface back from humanity and give them back the suffering and pain that we have endured. Understand, human? This is your only chance at redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. I'm dying. I'll help you fight. Yo! You did it! Undyne is right in front of you. You've got front row seats to her fight. Wait, who's she fighting? <laughs> hey, you aren't gonna tell my mom, my parents about this, are you? Welp, you're not gonna tell my parents about this, are you? Welp. Oh look, that would have been useful. You hear a passing conversation. Hmm, if I say my wish, you promise you won't laugh at me? Of course I won't laugh. Someday, I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under. Standing under the sky, looking at the world all around. That's my wish. You hear laughter. Hey! You said you wouldn't laugh at it! I'm sorry, I, it's just funny. And that's my wish too. That's sweet. However, there is a prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface. They will return and the underground will go empty. Yo! Yo, I know I'm not supposed to be here, but I want to ask you something. Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo, you're human, right? <laughs> Man, I knew it. Well, I know it now, I mean. 
Undyne told me. Um, stay away from that human. So, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies or something. But I kind of stink at that. <laughs> Yo, say something mean so I can hate you. Please? No. Yo, what? So I have to do it? Here goes nothing. Yo, I... I hate your guts. Man, I... I'm such a turd. I'm... I'm gonna go home now. Ooh. Yo, wait! Help! I tripped! Ooh. Get up. Y yo dude. If... if you want to hurt my friend, you're gonna have to get through me first. Whoa, you're so scary, cool monster kid. She's gone. Yo, you really saved my skin. Guess being enemies was just a nice thought. <laughs> we'll just have to be friends instead. Man, I should really go home. I bet my parents are worried sick about me. Later, dude. You should stop running. For one, you know. Specifically on bridges. Ooh. Er. Seven. Seven human souls and King Asgore will become a god. Six. That's how many we have collected thus far. Understand? Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as is customary for those who make it this far, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. It all started long ago. No. You know what? Screw it! Why should I tell you that story when you're about to die? Yeah! I can't be that loud. <laughs> you! You're standing in the way of everyone- <laughs> Of everybody's hopes and dreams. Alphys's history books made us think- Made me think humans were cool. With their giant robots and flowery swordsmen. But you? You're just a coward. Hiding behind that kid so you can run away from me again. And let's not forget your wimpy goody two-shoes shtick. Oh, I'm making such a difference by hugging random strangers. You know what would be more valuable to everyone? If you were dead. That's right, human. Your continued existence is a crime. Your life is all that stands between us and our freedom. Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts pounding together. Everyone's been waiting their whole lives for this moment. But we're not nervous at all. When everybody puts their hearts together, they can't lose. Now, human, let's end this. Right here, right now. I'll show you how determined monsters can be. Step forward when you're ready. <laughs> The wind is howling. You are filled with determination. Let me I hope this isn't too loud. Okay, it isn't. I'm gonna lower it down ever so slightly anyway so that I don't have to yell the entire time. That's it then. No more running away. Here I come. Unguard. And then attacks. Oh no, I forgot what green does. Check. Undyne, attack 50, defense 20. The heroine that never gives up. As long as you're green, you can't escape. Unless you learn to face danger head on. You won't last a second against me. Ooh. Yeah, it's one of these. I, for I completely forgot the mechanics of her battle. Undyne bounces impatiently. Uh Lead. You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. Not bad, then how about this? 
now. <laughs> and then holds her fist in front of her and shakes her head. Challenge. You tell Undyne her attacks are too easy, the bullets get faster. For years we've dreamed of a happy ending. Undyne towers threateningly. Told Undyne you didn't want to fight. Now some like oh, I didn't mean to. Then thinks of her friends and pounds the ground with her fists. I won't let you snatch it away from us. Oh. Smells like sushi. Yeah, enough warming up. That was warming up! So, thank you. Mercy? Ha! I still can't believe you want to spare me. And I'm bound to so patiently. But even if I spared you. No human has ever made it past Asgore. And then suplexes a huge boulder just because she can. Honestly, killing you now is an act of mercy. Hope. So stop being so damn resilient. I love you. Your HP is maxed out. Thank you. What the hell are humans made of? Uh, not magic? Or dust? Made of a lot of things. Mainly water. I think you'd like water. You're surrounded by it. So you should like me. I'm 70% water, therefore I'm 70% 70, 70 of something you like. Anyone else would be dead by now. told me humans were determined. I see now what she meant by that. Mm -hmm. But I'm determined too. Uh. Determined to end this right now. some CT. Uh. Right now. Sorry, I'm just resilient like that. take mercy from the likes of you. Well, you're kind of bad at it, but... Undyne's eyes start around to see if this is a prank. You will never spare me! 
um I am bro <laughs> that is hyperventilating you'll never escape from me I'm getting tired I'm feeling eepy smells like angry fish you'll never escape from me Twitching involuntarily. What do we gotta do? Do I need a flea? I'm out of here. Oh. <laughs> no, I'm out of here. Stop running away. Leave me alone. Come back here, you little punk. No, oh, I'm, I'm leaving. Welcome to hot. Hey, what's up? I was just thinking. You, me, and Undyne should all hang out sometime. I think you would make great pals. Let's meet up at her house later. Slow me down. Help. <laughs> Armor is so hot, but I can't give up. She looks dry. You see. As I said, we're 70% water. And you like water, so... There you go. Yes. Good morning. You, you can't just leave like that. The hell? Hello? He's not even here anymore. Bro, I almost got wasted. Uh, hello? Okay, 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 okay. I was thirsty, so I came over from Waterfall to get a drink. Are you just carrying that around to look sophisticated? Because it's not working. Okay. Anyway, I'm just gonna leave you then. The water evaporated from the heat. The cup evaporated too. Okay, okay, okay. Seeing such a strange laboratory in a place like this. You're filled with determination. Oh, it is. Tra la la, I am the river man. Or am I the river woman? It doesn't really matter. I love to ride in my boat. Would you care to join me? Yeah. Where will we go today? Uh, let's go to Waterfall. Then we're off. Tra la la la. Eat a mushroom every day. Why? Then I know you're listening to me. Come again sometime. Tra la la la. I'm coming again now. Because I want to go back. Yes. Hotland. 
Why are we going this way? Tralalala, -la -la, Temi Village. The room before the darkening lantern room. Thank you, river person. Come again sometime. Tralalala. -la -la. Or tralala. -la. I don't know. Same same thing to me. Yeah, anyway. With that, I think this is a great place to end off the video. Um, I hope you all have a wonderful day, night, or whatever time it is for you. I'm gonna try to start posting these again, you know, more often. I've just, I've just been pretty busy. Um, and yeah, I hope you all have a good one and always remember, I'm right behind you. Like Undinus. See ya on the flip side.